Yo, we're back. GeoGuessr 2069. One of my favorite maps of all time on GeoGuessr. I haven't really played it off camera, but it's basically like a complete world, but improved and we're basically just like GeoGuessr in 2069, the original version. Um, I still don't know what... I played GeoGuessr 2069 a couple of times, but I don't remember if they have every single country. But we'll play without time limit, we'll play no move, and we'll see what kind of meta we can get out of it. Um, so, okay, we have yellow plates. That immediately felt like Algeria with the yellow plates. But otherwise, uh, I mean, this language could be Berber, which I think it's Morocco. I don't know. Well, I think Algeria as well. Or is it just Algeria? I'm not sure. Um, yeah, we'll try not to look at the people, at the people's uh, like copyrights or whatever. Uh, but with the yellow plate, although it's a short one, it's still a Land Rover. I would probably go Algeria. But now this uh, black and white stripe pole is making me double think. I'll, I'll go with my gut feeling though. Buildings do indeed not feel very Algerian, but I'll go, I'll go, I don't know. It needs to be pretty dry, so maybe Biskra would make more, would make more sense than it was just Oman, which is fair enough. Uh, I, I'm looking forward to seeing Oman and GeoGuessr. It looks like a very fun country and pretty, pretty challenging when it comes to the UAE as well. Um, now here, strike poles, could be Taiwan. Uh, the stop sign is a bit weird to me, but uh, I'll go Taiwan. Could be China, actually. Is the plate blue? I cannot, well, this plate is not blue. The rest I, don't, I cannot see. And I can't see the steering wheel either. So I'll go Taipei, be safe. And okay, it was indeed Taiwan, just a bit more southwest. And here we are in the Middle East again. I don't think we're in Africa. It feels like in the Middle East. But where? A new leader for a new future, maybe? It rhymes. It's funny. We have a blue plate. Okay, interesting. I don't think it's Senegal. What country uses blue plates? Unless it's like a, a an industrial one or commercial or something. There's also English, which, which is throwing me off a little bit. We have a French-style ladder pole, which is throwing me off even more. Uh, I mean, I don't know the metas of poles in like in Egypt or Iraq or anything but yes yeah, since it's written in English I would bet it's probably Qatar or Bahrain or maybe Kuwait um also with the blue plate which is throwing me off I'll probably just go Kuwait and see uh so yeah let's see okay wow that was Cote d'Ivoire that's why there was the yeah that makes much more sense okay the French pole and the English language yes Cote d'Ivoire okay very nice very nice um okay here you can use the people i think um i don't know bhutan would make sense or north of india north of uh, nepal north of pakistan this is also very also the vegetation kind of fits i'm not too good with that but oh maybe myanmar i don't dislike myanmar here either what kind of i mean cambodia could make sense only talking about the houses when talking about the landscape, Cambodia would not make sense at all. Um, should I go Bhutan or Nepal? I don't think... I like Myanmar, but I don't think I want to go there. Maybe Nepal. And I know Butuan wouldn't... I kind of like Butuan here. It's not gigantic mountains. Feels Himalayan a little bit to me because of the low clouds and the high altitude. So I'll just go for it and see. And it was indeed Nepal. Just a bit more west, but a very, very nice location here. Um, okay, here we have a, yeah, a white plate, 99JA655. I don't think that means anything, but that kind of feels like Europe, even though, you know, there's painted trees like Poland, although, you know, the soil does not feel like Poland at all. But I cannot see a single blue stripe, so... I could maybe opt for Croatia, for, I don't know, Moldova at this point. Could be like Moldova close. I'd, um, Sorry, wait, no, Moldova has a blue stripe. So, okay, not Ukraine either. Should I just try and go Russia? I feel like it's a boring guess, but also this sign does not feel pretty particular to me. Uh, like pretty Russian, particularly Russian. Um... I don't know. It doesn't feel right for Russia. It does not. It feels a bit too sandy. Maybe I could go... No, the vegetation would not work. Maybe we're here. 
I do not like this guess at all, but uh, I'll just go for it and hope for the best. And uh, okay, it was it was in Azerbaijan. Okay, we got kind of the vibes. I should yeah indeed I should probably just uh, gone more south, but uh, no I'm I'm not mad about that guess at all. It was Azerbaijan, which is which makes sense for the lack of blue stripe. And while we are in a nice country here, I think I was gonna say Brunei with these flags, but no, but this is definitely Asian. We're also driving left, so that helps. We have a Nissan Leaf here. Um, man, that is beautiful. What the hell? Is it the Philippines? I was thinking... Uh, no, sorry. We're driving left. So, ex outer yellow lines as well as throwing me off. Could it be Brunei if they are driving left? The thing is, what kind of landscape would Brunei have here? That's the thing. So, maybe not. Maybe we're in... We're not in Japan. Are we not in Japan? I don't think so. No, no, no. The plate is too small. Um, this is beautiful. I don't know where to go. Um, maybe it could be Malaysia. But this plate is not good. Could it be Timor-Leste? Are they driving... Are they driving left there? Actually, I don't know if they have kind of this landscape in this blue water. So maybe not. Papua New Guinea is not... I don't dislike that. I know they have beautiful nature. But, you know... Man, this is throwing me off. Okay, I'll go. I'll go. I'll go. I don't like it. I don't like anything. What the hell? <laughs> um, I know, south of Malaysia. I don't think it's right. Yeah, this is not right. But uh, let's go here. Whatever. And it was... Wow, that was a Seychelles. That's make. That makes much more sense. But I, I would not have thought of the Seychelles at all. So, okay, that looks like Caucasus. I would just want to go, like, south of Azerbaijan or just Armenia or Azerbaijan here or even Iraq. Not gonna lie. Well, Iraq, Iran, that kind of area. I'll just go for it and see. And it was Lebanon. Okay, fair enough. Beautiful country with similar landscape, I believe. And this is... Um, I don't know. I do not know, but I feel like this is a, it, there's a name here. I won't look at it. I feel like this is the kind of map, uh, this is the kind of country that's covered. But this, oh, there's a yellow middle line. So it's probably the US, I guess. Yeah, uh, I don't know. I'll, I'll go like New Mexico and see. And okay, that was Panama. Fair enough. Yeah, the line arrows did not feel right, but I had to go for it. <laughs> um... Yeah, I would not think Panama right there. And here, interesting, that looks like, like Europe. Maybe Sweden, like north of Sweden with these big mountains. We're looking south, however, which I don't think there's any where in Sweden. Maybe here, actually. I mean, I don't dislike it, but there's, I don't see any big lake. So I would probably opt for something else. But I don't see anything. <laughs> um, actually, maybe we could be here. Um, yeah. It's not a great guess at all. I think we're in this region of the world, though. I don't think we're going to be in the Americas. So let's just send it. Uh, okay, I mean, it was in Europe, technically. We were in Bulgaria. Beautiful location. I'll try to remember that, even though it's a bit tough. But we're going to be in Portugal with these uh, yellow stripes. Also with this crosswalk, which is which the five lines are kind of close to each other, like Slovakia. Um, yeah, I don't know where to go. This, these buildings are pretty interesting to me. I, I would not, never go Coimbra here. Maybe Lisbon, maybe even more south, maybe Faro, uh, Quarteira. And I'll go for it because it does look pretty dry. So let's just do it. And it was it was just Lisbon. Uh, fair enough. 7.6. I'm not expecting high scores here. I'm just expecting to learn future metas. Um, so yeah, here, I don't have much to say about it, because I don't have anything, I, don't, I can't have an idea about this, I don't know why it's throwing me off, I was thinking maybe Vietnam, um, but where in Vietnam would it be so dry like this, maybe north, even that, also there's palm trees, which I think makes sense for Vietnam, but... You know, there's a dry part here, apparently, but it looks fairly flat as well. So maybe we're just south. Yeah, let's go for it. And it was the DRC. Wow, that was that was insanely difficult for me. 
Okay. Okay, okay. Um, is that... Wait, no, that's not Turkey. Is that Croatia? Do we have a blue stripe? We can't see any plate, but... I think these poles could be Croatian, but I'm not too sure. I'll still go for it. And, uh, no, it was North Macedonia. Okay, I know, I'm really bad at North Macedonia, so... I'm not too mad about it. Is that just Norway? Look at these people. Maybe they're a Norwegian. Um, also, the high mist over there is... Could confirm it. However, this house does not feel Norwegian at all. This is a bit weird. We could just also be near the Alps or even Belgium, Luxembourg. I could see that. Um, okay, we have... I think that's a white plate. Obviously, it's so misty that I can't really say anything about it. Um, I mean, I don't mind Germany. Maybe close to Czechia. Yeah. Well, let's just go for it. And it was... Okay, it was Croatia. Okay, fair enough. Uh, I'm I'm happy I didn't go Norway here because yes, the house did not feel like it, and uh, yeah. So here, I'm thinking Africa, not. Well, I mean, there's Arabic, but I don't think it's gonna be a Middle East. I don't know why. Um, vibes purely. I I probably would go just Khartoum. Um. I don't have much. Uh, they're driving right. They're driving. Oh no, we're driving right. Yeah, yeah, we are. There's a yellow plate here, uh, which I don't know. I'm not too sure. I could see Eritrea here as well. Let's just guess it. Uh, it was Libya. Okay. I'm not too sure if Sudan is covered and Jew guess for 2069. So that should be... I should look more into it. Uh, yeah, okay. So oh, here, Europe, definitely. Where, however, where, where, where in Europe? Okay, let's look at, let's look at the poll. Oh man, I know this is a meta. With the hole starting here, they're going down to the bottom. And even these insulators, I think, are a meta. Okay, they have, we have some stuff in the back, in the bed, in the truck bed. Okay, uh, that feels kind of Greek. Feels kind of Bulgarian. I'll just go for it. I'm afraid I was wrong. And that's why the pole was like this, because it was a Chilean pole. I never thought a single second about Chile. So that was a difficult round to me. Uh, we have a plate with a blue stripe, if I saw it correctly. This is a gorgeous bridge. This is beautiful. Um, I don't know. This feels like a German plate, from what I can see. But obviously, I don't think with this water, this beautiful water, it could be it. Uh, maybe Greece. Greece, I would not be mad to guess Greece here. I don't know, but the like kind of long bridge. And I mean, there's not that much. It's not a big city on either side. So I would probably need to pick a, um, a kind of remote bridge. Not this one. Also, we need to look at the angle of the bridge. Oh, shit. I didn't. I swear I did not read. Okay, let's try and angle it like this. I did not read. I'll just search for it. Maybe we can't. Maybe it's not there. Maybe it's not Greece. Miss Turkey? Mm, not too sure. The water is really, really blue. And I kind of want to stay in Greece just because of that. But if it's not... I don't know what it could be. I'm not gonna lie. It may be just not be Greece, because maybe the plate was just a bait. Okay, let's go here. I don't think it's gonna be there, but okay. It was Croatia? Yeah, it was Croatia. Okay, that bridge. Makes sense. There was a li this little village, and here there was nothing. Makes, 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 makes a lot of sense. Why did I say makes uh, like five times? I don't know. Okay. Um, I don't know what to think. To think. <laughs> Once again, this run is a bit throwing me off. The poles, the vegetation, these palm trees, um, this faded sign. Hmm. Wow, okay, uh, we have, wow, what a mix of vegetation. That, I, there's no white line, so I would probably go Europe. However, where can we find all of this? I don't think it's Europe. I'm just going Europe, I think, because they're driving right, but I could probably stick to it. Maybe it's Turkey, like, Marmaris area, Antalya. Not quite confident, because the poles are not telling me that it's Turkey. 
but I, I can see it. It's not out of my options. So I'll just go for it. I don't like, I don't like my guess and it was just Ghana. Makes sense. You know, learning Ghana would probably be good if we don't focus on the tape. Especially for me, because I'm terrible at first region guessing Ghana, and now that we don't have tape, I did not recognize the vegetation, which probably is very unique to this area of the world. And we have... Okay, no, that's not a blue plate. Uh, that's not a black tape. Okay, are we in Quebec? Are we in Ontario? It's a single yellow line, so maybe more the US. However, the vegetation is very Canadian to me. I mean, could be... I guess it could be Seattle area. But it would be more mountainous. So I think I'll opt for Quebec. Because they use, well, we use sometimes single yellows. Although Nova Scotia does as well. And that kind of fits for Nova Scotia. Um, I would probably just go near Antigonish. Um, let's see what the road does. Like this. I'm pretty bad at I, aligning a road when it's just like this. So let's go Trans-Canadian. I don't think it's the right angle anyways. Uh, it was Quebec. It was Quebec. It was here. Um, yeah, that was a tough one. I don't think I would have gotten that, even if in, I knew we were in Quebec. Uh, Ireland, I guess. The, these houses feel Ireland. Feels Irish. Sorry. Um, yeah, I'll just go for it. Also, the brick wall feels definitely, definitely feels... Uh, I, oh my god, what a guess. Very nice guess. And here, to finish this off, uh, we're just in Thailand. Yeah, okay, we are in Thailand. Can we read anything? Is there language? I mean, is this something nine? I cannot read this symbol. Unless, I'm not too sure. I started learning Thai, so that can that could have helped, but we don't have any language. It does feel, wait, hold on. It does feel, well, yes, it is mountainous, but kind of dry as well. Maybe close to Laos, or even could be far east. I could see that. I could actually, let's just try it. Let's have fun. And okay, oh my God. That's why I didn't recognize the language. Oh, Sri Lanka. Oh my God. Okay, uh, let's play one last game. Let's try and beat more. Let's try and get more than 10,000. Cause I've gotten, I had a lot of below 10,000 uh, scores. Um, yeah, uh, no. Chiapia? Not too sure. Ush, Ushhod. We're not in Ushhorod. This is way too flat to be Ushhorod. Um, unless, wait, hold on. Ushhorod is not in the, in the mountainous part. It's, uh, besides it, yeah, okay. I mean, I don't think it's going to be that. Because, uh, yeah, it is Ush, Ushhorod. It's not Ushhorod. It's uh, Ushhod something. I'm, I'm sorry for all the Cyrillic language, any Cyrillic language speaker watching my video. Um, yeah, I don't know. I would probably, what, where should I go here? Where should I go? Just because the bus is white, is yellow, I want to go Ukraine. I'm not going to lie. Okay, let's just stick to Ushara and, and not talk about it. And it was Minsk. Fair enough. Uh, there was not it was not written there so I'm not too mad about it is that Turkey that's Italy it was Russian so I was thinking Turkey immediately <laughs> but no okay it is Italy that makes much more sense and I think it's gonna be close to France actually I think that makes a lot of sense with the building kind of with the building architecture I was thinking maybe San Bremo close to uh, Nice and Monaco obviously it couldn't be anywhere but it's just my vibe my vibe feels like it, and it'll just go, guess for it. And, oh man, it was Monaco. Damn, why did I not think about it? I don't I don't know, because there was multiple languages, probably. Uh, we got the building vibes, though, at least, with the architecture. Um, okay, we are driving left with Arabic on it, with with Arabic as, a lang as the main language, I believe. Huh, is that, s that's not Somalia. I don't remember which countries are covered. I know, oh, I think the Sahel is not covered, like all of these. I think Sudan is not. So Mauritania, Mali, Niger, Chad, and Sudan are all not covered. South Sudan either, I think. But okay, we're driving left. And there's Arabic. Could it be Morocco? Uh, no, Morocco doesn't drive left. 
I mean, Kenya drives love, but there's there no they don't speak Arabic. Which damn country uses that? It's not Indo, obviously. Also, it's a white plate, and it's only Arabic. Like, there's no doesn't feel like there's an official second language that people speak or something. Um. Wow, that is that is an interesting round. Maybe it is Kenya, but super north. However, there would be some English at some point, somewhere. Tanzania? Oh man, that, that is really, really weird to me. Because all of this part of Africa, I think they all drive. Oh, wait, could it be? No, Comoros would not be flat like this and boring. Well, boring. Um, like just generic landscapes. I'm sorry for taking my time, but this is a... Very interesting one. And I cannot think of any country that drives left. Except, you know, the Seychelles, but we're obviously not in the Seychelles. And I don't think we're in, I don't think we're in Comoros or Mauritius. Plus they Mauritius speaks French anyways. Um and Seychelles English, right? I think. I I, I kinda like my Kenya I guess. Cause I don't think Somalia is covered. It could be. And if it is, I think it could be somewhere. I'm not gonna lie. Oh my god, we're not driving left. I'm sorry, I'm taking a moment of silence for myself, for my ignorance. Um. Yeah, so basically that just opens up every single country on Earth. <laughs> Man, I don't know where to go, though. Let's just go... I don't know... Fucking Saudi Arabia. Oh my god, it was Iran. I'm so sorry about this. Please don't bully me, actually. Uh, you can. I deserve it. We're driving left, we're driving left. Bro, shut up and just look. <laughs> um, via... Villa lol Villa lol <laughs> We're in Panama the, the wait we're in Panama yeah <laughs> this is the the I don't know where it was but uh yeah okay nice thank you for this uh I I just got lucky with this this was a pure far not fuck you around but like here let's let uh, take the L and just guess correctly and that was uh, okay that was Namibia wow uh, 16k I mean that was more than 10k which I wanted <laughs> so yeah um yep that's gonna be it I'm I'm gonna post part four of the journey at some point in the next week I guess I'm gonna try learning some more countries I don't know which ones like I should do maybe Ghana reading guess in Ghana would be good for me um redoing Australia redoing South Africa would help also Brazil uh yeah that's pretty much it maybe even mongolia because i'm not good at mongolia uh, even though we don't get it off often uh it would still be good anyways thank you for watching and i uh, will see each other very soon